Illumifier here. Today I'm going to show you how to make it always day or always night on your single player world or online server by using command blocks and daylight sensors. Afterwards I'm going to show you how to make it always clear, raining, or stormy by using the same method. We'll start by giving ourselves a command block and so far there's only one way to do this and that is by getting it through the console. And if you're on a multiplayer server you're going to have to find your server properties file. Go to where it says enable command block and set that to true. Since you're getting it through the console you're going to have to have cheats enabled on your map for this to work. To get your command block you're going to type slash give your username and the ID for it is 137. In order to make it always day on your map you're going to throw down your command block right click it and type in time set 1000 and the reason why we make it 1000 instead of 0 is because when we set it to 0 it kinda gives you that dark feeling from when it's transitioning from night to day and we want it so that when this command block activates it goes straight to the full daytime so you don't notice the change so after you've set that to 1000 you put a redstone torch behind it and 10 layers of redstone wiring behind that At the end of that, you're going to throw down your daylight sensor. And that is going to make it always daytime on this server. And the reason why I make it 10 redstone wiring long is because that's the shortest amount of redstone wiring I can use without seeing the transitions from night to day. So it just transitions without you even noticing a thing. Now I'm going to show you how to make it always night, which is as easy as it comes. All you do is throw down a command block right click it and type in time set 14,000 and the reason why I do 14,000 is because 14,000 is the first part of the night where it becomes completely dark and then behind that you just throw down a daylight sensor and the second this gets a little bit of light it's going to activate the command block and then setting it back to nighttime again and it's as easy as that simplest design ever this is something pretty cool I found that you can mess with. If you activate them both at once, it makes a cool strobe light across the map. I don't know what the uses of it would be, but I think it's still pretty cool. Hello little bat. Welcome to my video. You know, fine, get out of here. I didn't like you anyways. Now I'm gonna show you how to make Seriously, will you get out of here? Okay, anyways, now I'm going to show you how to make it always clear on your server rather than raining or stormy. And to do this, you're going to have to have your time set 1000 on because they work with each other. First off, you'll throw down your command block and type in weather clear. And you'll do the same exact thing as the first one. Throw down your redstone torch and then 10 layers of redstone. And then lastly, with the daylight sensor at the end. And what this does is every time the day resets itself, it activates both of these and making it always clear and always sunny at the same time. Now to make it always rain on your server is just a little bit more difficult. And the reason for this is because when it's raining, your daylight sensors give off two less blocks of redstone. And when it's thundering, they give off four less. So if you want it to always rain on your server, you're going to have to move your command blocks one back. And if you want it to always thunder on your server, you're going to have to move them three back. Now as you can see, I've moved them both three back so I can show you how to make it always thundering on your server while it's daytime. So for the first command block, you're going to keep it at time set 1000. And for the second one, you're going to set it as weather, thunder, or rain, depending on which one you do. But remember, if you do weather, rain, you're going to have to move both of the command blocks back two spots. And lastly, I'm going to show you how to make it always raining or thundering on your server while it's also always nighttime. So first, let me break this. And the first thing you do is throw a daylight sensor behind the block that says time set 14,000. And behind the command block that says weather thunder or weather rain, you're going to throw another daylight sensor. And now it will always be raining and also always nighttime. Now there is one problem I came across while working with these command blocks, 
and it was that if I wandered too far away from them and the chunk unloaded, then they stopped being effective and it started going to night again. So you have to keep that in mind. Probably build them somewhere around your home so you're always nearby. And that is how you permanently change the weather and time of day in your single player world or online server by using command blocks and daylight sensors. Hey thanks a lot for watching and if you enjoyed the video please give me a thumbs up and please subscribe to me so you can see some of my other cool creations.